at the intersections controlled by traffic light, you can come across these diamond shapes. Usually there's two of them in a lane or sometimes you can see circles. Circles are more often used. This is a traffic control device embedded in the pavement. What we have here is an inductor coil. The pavement is cut with a circular saw blade and uh, either in a diamond or just a circle and wire is laid into it, just copper wire with jacketed copper wire. A worker comes and lays down four or five loops and then there's more uh, cuts made in the pavement. They all run together here to a junction box that's covered with the leaves and there's also an access, uh, a traffic control access hole here. So what happens here is that electricity runs through this copper wire, some low voltage like 24 volts, and uh, that electricity in this coil, which is uh, half a transformer, in this coil electricity is generated as well, uh, or electricity runs, so a magnetic field is generated around these loops here. Invisible magnetic fields, if I had iron filings, they would line up like so above the road here. You can check it with a compass. So what happens is when a vehicle comes over it with uh, steel in it, steel of course is magnetic, it changes or messes with or distorts the magnetic field that's around this uh, diamond shape or circular shape. The changing magnetic field will uh, do changes to will uh, change the amount of current running through the wires because the vehicle serves as the iron core for a transformer. So this is half a transformer, just an inductor coil. So the vehicle changes the magnetic field, and uh, and, and and then the brains that are buried here in the pavement initiate a cycle, initiate changing the lights from red to green because they detect that vehicles arrived here. So this kind, of, this kind of traffic control device lasts about five years because the cables are buried in a shallow like a one inch deep cut and the pavement shifts and moves under the weight of heavy trucks and, and the copper uh, wire can get cut. And if it's severed, there is no magnetic field, so we, there are no changes to the magnetic field, and it always, the light always stays red, doesn't cycle to change to green. Fairly straightforward. Now this design, they moved away from it. This is an older design. These diamonds, they they went to circles because the diamonds have sharp corners, where the where the. Uh, copper wire that's laid in takes a sharp turn so it's most likely to get cut uh, with the shifting moving settling pavement so uh, the uh, they are doing circles now circles outlast these diamond shapes so that's what this is a traffic control device and it's based on electricity and magnetism